You're viewing the Chess Genius Chess Computer, a strong chess computer program by Richard Lang that offers some wonderful features for playing chess against a computer. I want to show you some particular aspects that I like about this machine and demonstrate how a computer works in general. On this chessboard, each square has coordinates named E2, E4. The squares are pressure sensitive, so when you make your move, you'll press on the square from and to. To turn on this machine, press the power button, and notice the LCD lights up, and it says play. A new game is ready to be played. To turn on or off the uh, backlighting, press this button here. Let's go ahead and start a game. I'll press the E2 square to E4, and the computer immediately responds to say G8 F6, also showing that on the display. I might respond with Knight B1 to C3, and the computer again responds with a pawn move e7 to e5. Now there are many functions that you can access here. Anything from hints to information about the game to, in this case, the information shows book and it shows uh, also that you can take back at any point. What I did was pressed the back arrow here and that shows what the last moves were and what to take back. In this case, knight back to b1 and back again, f6 to g8. To move forward, just press the forward arrow and we'll soon be back at the position where we were playing. And clear saves that. Now if you would like the computer to move as white, press the Move key. The computer is saying G1 to F3. Move again. F8 to B4. So whether you're an advanced player looking for the highest levels on this with tournament or fast games, or a beginner, you can also set this computer to play at a very uh, low level give you less of a challenge, but the best thing is it is programmed to have somewhat of a human-like playing style. So you'll be able to play chess at any time against this machine. There are a number of menu settings available to you here by pressing the menu key. When you press menu, then cycle left or right, and you'll see various functions. Analysis, options, set up a, a game, and so on. Level settings. To enter any of these functions, press the Enter key. To go back, just clear. You're back to playing the game. So there are many options you can explore, but the main thing is playing chess against the computer with a pressure-sensitive board for move input. And magnets do hold the pieces in place, not enough to invert this, but at least to make it quite stable. This is powered by three AA batteries. Right here. Or an optional AC adapter, which plugs in right here. And then there is a piece compartment for the dark and light pieces. So that's a quick introduction to the Chess Genius Chess Computer and its basic functions.